Hello everyone, welcome back to the fourth episode of this series, which is the International Wonder Kids Twins. So as you can see, the uh, five sets of twins on our screen. Remember in episode two, Oliver Kazunu disappeared from the game, guessing he just didn't sign for anyone and for long enough and got cut. So, yeah, uh, we're three years into the future, 2021, 9th of July. This is when a lot of our players' contracts ended. Not all of them. Because some signed on until 2022, but some, some just ended at 2021. So we'll have a look at that. First, we'll try and have a look at the leagues and the awards. So here you can see Player of the Month, blah, blah, blah. Manager of the Month, Jose Mourinho, how he's still at the club. So you can have a look here. And next year, we're going to have a World Cup special. So we'll have a look more at the World Cup. The I did see that the... Um, so, uh, that the Euros, the Euro, um, ch European Championship Euro was, um, won by France and Romania came second. I don't know how, don't know why, but that's just what happened. So, in the Champions League, Tottenham came first, Bayern Munich came second. In the Europa League, Barcelona, why are they so far down? They, well, they won anyways against Porto. In the English, in the Premier League, um, these are the teams for next year. Brentford have managed to get up. Don't know how. Hull up. Everton are still there. Good. Some teams that aren't there. That looks like most teams are there. A few teams that aren't there. Aston Villa aren't up there. Um, anyway, history. Last year, Man City won it for the fourth year running. So their team looks god by the sound of it. Yep, still pretty much have the same team as every other year. So that's good by them. Um, awards. The Players Player of the Year, Raheem Sterling, Young Player, Kanos, Anthony Martial, Player of the Month. Football of the Year went to Harry Kane. Have a look at who came second, third. That guy that I don't know, and Obiang I've heard of, but I don't really know much about him. And good player anyway we'll have a first look at our players so basically first we'll have a look at Jackson Kazunu because there's only one of him now unless somehow they they've added him back into the game which I don't I doubt Kazunu there's Jackson Kazunu still with Averton but he did um, sign, have a contract till 2022 so that makes a bit sense strength is good. Is that better than last year though? I'm not sure. He's eighteen years of it. eighteen years of age. He's eighteen years old. Um did play sixteen games, got a goal and an assist. He's a striker, should be doing better than that. I think he's a striker, yep. Um had a worse season than the previous year but did get more starts. Achievements, no major achievements. Um personal. Happy to stay at the club. Poor morale, which is not good. Um, positions still the same. So, his team, uh, Vanarama North, did they get relegated? Nope, they've always been Vanarama North. Came 18th, just worse than last year. But doesn't 18th get you relegated? Oh no, it's 24 clubs. 22 clubs, never mind. So, they stay out of relegation just. So that's not looking too good for Kazunu. That's what the player that I thought was going to do the best, but obviously not. We'll have a look at the Adamitises. They were both at Fylde last time I checked. And they both still are. Domas has gone up in value, I'm pretty sure. Signed a... I think that's a smaller contract than he did. But has signed on for an extra four years. I want, he hasn't played a game for Lithuania. I wonder if his brother did the same. He's 18 now. Happy to stay at club. Feels like he works well with their assistant manager. Um, didn't play a game. I think he's, I would say he's um, loan listed. No, no loan listed. Oh, wow. He has not played a game at all, so it's not good. Achievements, nothing. Go back to see. Oh, they're in Skybat League 2. Okay, they're in League 2. So they've got the promotion. 
So they came first, which is good for them. Aros, on the other hand, played 11 games for Lithuania, which is amazing. It's great strength, better pace. Um, looks like definitely one of the best players in this save. Um, I'm thinking of making another save, guys. Um, Southampton um, return to the Premier League. We're going to try and... Last time I have the stats up here on my computer. Last time they... The highest they've ever been in the Premier League era was 1999-2000. They came 7th. So we're going to try and get them up to that 7th spot again. They're currently in League 1 or Championship, pretty sure, League 1 after two consecutive um, relegations. Anyway, Aros has played 5 games for them that year. Got 6.6 .6 rating, so not amazing, but his play, that's good. Achievements. Oh! Oh yeah, his club was promoted, that makes sense. He must have played in the promotion game or something like that. Anyway, our next set of brothers are going to be the Levi brothers from Northern Ireland. See how they're going on. I'm pretty sure they're the ones both in Germany. Germ Germany. Yep. So both still at the same club. Hopefully they're not too loyal. Otherwise we might have to change that. We don't want to see the same club every year. But that is good of them. Good of them. Um, 325k, third division, no achievements of note, contract, signed on for another four years, I'm not sure if they'll keep him there. He played two games for their second team, no games for their first team, which is disappointing. Personal, he's happy to stay at the club. William Levi, he had a contract till 2022, so he's won't expire for a while. Um, great aerial, a great player all around. 10k value though, because he's gone, been put back into his second team. But he played eight games, got a yellow card, didn't do anything of note. Six rating, that's all right, not amazing. Um, contract, yeah, till next year. Personal, he feels happy to stay at the club. Interesting. Um. Next player, next twins we have are the Whites, which are the Australians. Then after that we just have the Canadians, the Walkers, to go. So three years in, they're both still at Fylde. Both signed on for four years, I presume. Oh, Gary White's signed on for five years. We'll have a look at him first. He's not a great player. Got a bit of a crappy wage. Um, Bruett is a vital part of the team. Happy to stay at the club, which is weird. Not really much to do with the contract. History, didn't play a game. Achievements, nothing. So, how loyal are these players? He still has a crap ability, according to this. When will he get better? Um... Movement, no, that's nothing to do with it. I don't know how you make them loyal or not on mobile, but we're going to go over to Vince White, who signed only for four years, not five years. Great pace for a left wing. Um, oh, he's played two games for the national team. Interesting, interesting. Not in that team listed at the moment, as far as I can see. But has played two games, which is good. Um, happy to stay at the club. History, he played two games that season, got a goal and a yellow card. I don't know why they aren't playing him more, he's got an average rating of 8 with the yellow card, that's saying he's good. Club promoted, must have played, because he played games, they get the that's that. Um, that's all. Um, next one is the Walkers from Canada. Let's see how they're getting on. Walker, 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 Walker. There they are. Devontae Walker still at Forest Green. Value, is that the same or more? I can't tell. Canada, he's got another few caps. Um, They're not doing amazing. They're all right. Fixtures, did he play in any of these games? I don't know. Is he in the team? If I went to Canada... 
Would you find him in the team? Let's see. Yeah, Devontae Walker um, and Dion Walker are both in the team. Devontae Walker is the defensive mid. So, hasn't played a game since that 18-19 season. No major achievements. How is Forrest Green actually going? He's become a vegan, guys. It's not good. If you haven't watched the non-vegan lover, go to Isaac Butterfield. Great YouTuber. Um, anyway, contract 2026. Wow, he's just signed a huge contract. Um, Forrest Green. Oh, he's in their reserves. Okay, that makes a bit more sense. Club League History. They came ninth in Skybat League 2, so they're, they're slowly getting up to League 1 level. And Dion Walker still with Billy Rike. And they are also in Skybat League 2 now. So the brothers might play against each other every now and then. Played. No get. Oh, wait, what? They just skipped the year. What does that mean? Nervous about representing his country. Okay. That's alright, that's alright. Everyone gets nervous playing their first game for their country. Um, could you have a whole nation that you could let down if you do something wrong? Listed for loan. No achievements. How is their club going on? Um, I came third in... Oh no, they're coming third. I'm alphabetical. Came third in Vanarama National. Which is good. So both, so two pets of our twins today got um, well in the previous season, got uh promoted. So that's good, and we'll see a lot of them in the same leagues. And actually, three pairs of our twins. We have Gary and Vince White with filed, Aris and Domas with filed, and then Dion and Von, uh, Devon Dion got. Uh, with Billy Rique and Devonte uh, with, is with Forest Green, so we have six of our players in the same amount, same league, which is amazing. The Kazunus, they're still lower down. Well, Oliver's not playing, um, and Levi's both in Germany. So, thank you very much for watching this video. Stay tuned for the next one. Chase, stay tuned for the Sunderland, um, back to the Prem series maybe. Um, Stay tuned for any other videos. Uh, thank you guys for watching so much. Please like, subscribe, share with your friends if you enjoyed. Bye.